Uh, so this is Berriton, uh, and they have a Dark Sky Discovery site in their village green, which we'll go to in a minute. But the trickiest thing is actually finding the car park off the main road. So this is the main road that goes through Berriton, and you're aiming for that little kind of alleyway that way, and that takes you up into the car park. Um, it's just a short drive around the corner, and there's lots of spaces, as we'll see, but this is where you're aiming for. It's kind of nondescript, very difficult to find in the dark alleyway. So once you've found the car park at Berriton, right next to the village hall, which is this building here, you will see that they have a lovely big playing field for you to come out and uh, start looking at the stars. Now you are slightly at the whim of the lighting that comes out of the, uh, the village hall and from the, the residences around, but you get some really good decent views here. And this is slightly different from a Butzer a Dark Sky Discovery site, which is a few miles just over that hill. So whereas Butts has got those nice big open panoramic skies, you do get a lot of the light pollution from the south, but here in Berriton, the downs kind of act as a bit of a natural filter, kind of like a dark pair of sunglasses, and they cut out a lot of that sky glow from the south, which makes this site feel a bit darker, so that's really good. But the really good thing about this site is once you've had a lovely evening looking at the stars, is there is a pub just down the road. Can't knock that, can you? 